Also wanted to note that today the Food and Drug Administration announced two proposed rules, one to prohibit menthol cigarettes and one to prohibit flavor, flavored cigars. The rules announced today would enforce regulations related to what stores sell and what companies manufacture and distribute, which is a critical uh, critical action to prevent children from becoming the next generation of smokers, help adult smokers quit, and significantly reduce tobacco-related health. Take back the streets. It doesn't matter whether or not the person that is accosting your son or daughter or my son or daughter, my wife, your husband, my mother, your parents, it doesn't matter whether or not they were deprived as a youth. It doesn't matter or not whether or not they had no background that enabled them to have to uh, become a, a social, uh, become socialized into the fabric of society. It doesn't matter whether or not they're the victims of society. The end result is they're about to knock my mother on the head with a lead pipe, shoot my sister, beat up my wife, take on my sons without any conscience developing because they literally, I yield myself three more minutes, because they literally have not been socialized. They literally have not had an opportunity. We, a portion of them will become the predators 15 years from now. And Madam President, we have predators on our streets. Joe Biden, when this speech he gave, I mean, I was really offended. I heard it right outside the state capitol building in Dover, which mm -hmm. was a rundown, ransacked old house, 250 years old. Mm -hmm. And he said, Negro children are like roaches. If they're allowed to integrate the schools, they will infest them and they will never be gotten out. When I marched in the civil rights movement, I marched with tens of thousands of others to change attitudes. But he never actually marched in the civil rights movement at all. They are often the kinds of kids that are called super predators. No conscience, no empathy. We can talk about why they ended up that way, but first we have to bring them to heal. You called out President Clinton for defending Secretary Clinton's use of the term super predator back in the 90s when she supported the crime bill. Why, why did you call him out? Because it was a racist term and everybody knew it was a racist term. No conscience. It's a very well thought out crime bill that is both smart and tough. No empathy. Okay. Called black youth You're trespassers. Let, 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 Please explain let, the record. Speak. Because it was a racist term and everybody knew it was a racist term. I know it's hard for you all to believe that the man that they show in the media is different. I'm here to tell you this is a different man.